Okay. So, uh, I'm each of these superstars. Uh, now it's time I actually get my word in. Tiger, knowing him, he, it, it's like he doesn't care. He didn't have a lot to say about me. Just realized I'm called the mask loser, and it's not important. He can't take anyone seriously if someone calls him that. But his words don't mean anything. The fact I was reading out, I was hearing him out with his promos, it's, it's something. However, Jason, Jason had a lot to say. Trust me, he had a lot to say. He thinks that I had the attention on the crowd than the actual opponent which is false. I've just been training up almost day in, day out, just to be sure that I am mentally, physically, and hell, spiritually prepared. And when this match happens, don't be surprised if I walk out victorious and you guys don't. Alright? Because you see, the fact of the matter is, is that you think... I'm just like, so focused with the crowd, I'm focused with my fans, I'm focused with everybody. But the thing is, I'm really focused, most importantly on you, Jason. Because see, I've read your promos during the days, day in and day out, 24-7. I've heard it all from you. And I admit, your promo work is absolutely amazing. Don't get me wrong. But sometimes you just... Don't fully commit to what you say. Sure, you might be ready. You may or may not. Who knows? But the real fact is that, Jason, you have a clean record, a solid one win. Not bad. I admit it. That's very good work. Very good. And when I think of Tiger Take Taylor, he's have, he has a lot on his record, too. But the thing is, is that wins and losses from the past don't mean anything until you actually put work into it. See, I've had my wins, I've had my losses, and now that's not all important. What is important is this match between me and... Jason, Tiger. They all are ready. I'd, I'd say, I hope they're ready. Because, well, if they aren't ready, what's the point of being ready for a match that they're not even ready for? Well, I can answer that question. It's to outsmart them. To predict their moves. To predict what they have planned going into the match. And that is basically what I plan on doing. You see, when they're distracted or they have their backs turned against me, I'm going to use that as every opportunity I can get. And once the bell rings, the ref raises my hand while I hold the championship very high. You'll be hearing the words, here is your winner and the inaugural ANPW champion, Ty. Matthews, then you guys will all realize, you will all wake up to a bit of reality and realize that the era of Ty has just begun. The path back to success, that climb to the mountain will continue on as long as I'm here. And I'm going to be a hard working champion. I know I've had my title wins before. I know they've gone downhill. I know they were not my best runs. But if and when I do become champion, that's all going to change. That will all change. I will be a hard-working superstar. I'll be a hard-working fighter. I'm going to be a determined champion. Now, you can all just say, oh, it's just all talk. And, like, no action, right? You guys can say that. But when you realize 
that all my talk wasn't just words and they actually lead to actions, you will realize is that I'm a person to not mess with. I'm a person that is done, like, trying to be the nice guy. Because don't get me wrong, I respect each and every one of you. I respect Jason going into this match. I respect Tiger for going into this match. But when the bell rings, the respect is not there. All respect goes out the window. So, Tiger, you can say that you can't take me seriously because I have a nickname called The Masked Loser, all right? And, Jason, you can say I'm keeping my eyes to the crowd, to the fans, to the universe, but not you guys. You can say all that, but that's not what's true. I have my eyes right on the prize, and I know you and Tiger does as well. I'm well aware of that. So to the both of you guys, to the two of you, Tiger, Jason, I wish I could say I wish you all the best of luck. But I'm not going to do that. Because we know this fight can get very messy. This fight can get very serious. And I hope that you two are a lot more prepared and ready for this match as I am. Because I have my eyes set on that prize. Nothing else, nothing more. I hope you guys are ready for a match. I hope you guys are trained up for it too. Because for me, I'm training to fight a war. I'll see you guys at Hollow Screen.